Don't flop, ain't birthday, we'll back a stylus and leave If you're in the building, make a better noise yeah. Second bar of the day, make sure you do go and cop the merchandise at www.donflop.com forward slash shop and also follow the Twitter and Facebook which is below. On the right hand side, an absolute legend in Don't Flop, I'd say so myself. Make a bit of noise for Ogmios. Yeah. And on the left hand side, one half of the two on two current title champions. Make a bit of noise for Marlo. Yeah. There was no flip involved in this battle, Marlow decided he wanted to go first, so it's round one on Marlow, let's go. Are you ready? Yeah! Yo, so it's Marlow versus Ogmios. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> That's the match we're commencing with. Briggs just introduced us. <laughs> it's the battle he said it is. <laughs> what, do you already know that anyway? You're at the event it's in! <laughs> Yet in the first line of the battle, still casually mentioned. <laughs> What's it like to be bald? <laughs> Does the look shine through? Look at me, Ivan. I don't want to say goodbye to, I hate my barber. Scared of what that crook might do. I mean, I don't want to wake up one day and look like you! <laughs> I'm sorry. For some days I just think I'll take the plunge, you know? Put this crap to an end. Grab the clipper and go berserk like Tony Montana and his friend. I have moments where I think to myself, how bad can it get? Then I look at you and I think, fucking hell. <laughs> my hair, man. Because it's like the doctor always said, when the follicles are dead, the follicles are dead. Well, of course, I went to see a trichologist instead. Now, suddenly, anything is possible with meds. Yeah? The godliest of threads would be dropping to my neck. Was I a blonde or a brunette? He started promising me dreads. It was some, it was some miracle cure, but like, how costly could it get? He said that'll be $376 for the set. I said dollars, he said yes. Now I'm 300 pounds out of pocket and in debt and not a single new lock of hair has blossomed on my head! That's probably just stress. <laughs> what? <laughs> it was bonding with my friend. Ogmios, you're alright. All pride. And I can't help it if I finally have more hair than my opponent. That's the chemo's fault. <laughs> <laughs> It's hair joke time, if I may be so bold. Because your head looks like a phrenology head on a philosopher's shelf rack. If that hairless ceiling could share its feelings, it would sing an Adele track. You get sentimental. VO5 gel pack, you smell that. Michael Stipe from REM called. He wants himself back. When Earth set up this match, I knew it was you from the way he told me. Didn't even name you, homie, just sent me a skull face emoji. <laughs> then the leaf emoji. <laughs> then the tree emoji. <laughs> then the peace emoji. <laughs> then the tea emoji. <laughs> then the soup emoji. <laughs> then the pee emoji. I said, oh, can you please? Stop sending me emojis. <laughs> what are you doing? He said, come on, you've, uh, you've got a new opponent, mate. I said, okay, great, who is he? He said, no, no, wait. Oh, wow. Then the praying emoji, some more nature emojis. I said, Jesus Christ, what are you saying here, homie? Then the letter O, then the letter G, then the letter M, then the letter I, then the letter O, then the letter D. I said, oh, me odd. Then the letter S with an asterisk. <laughs> I said, right, Ogmios. He said, yeah, do you want to battle him? I said, um, fine. 
<laughs> When's it happening? <laughs> then he sent me the calendar emoji time time time. <laughs> <laughs> about going bald. That's just one of those things. It's funny you're into Maltese and now you're molting. <laughs> so wispy. I've never seen hair wispier. If your hair could talk, it would... <laughs> if your hair could talk, it would talk. If your hair could talk, it would be a whisperer. If it couldn't, it'd be a good listener. If, if it could sing, it would be Christopher. <laughs> He's from Reading. Marlo, not Christopher. <laughs> He's from Reading. In Reddingshire. <laughs> or, or wherever Shire. All I know is he left the Shire like a hobbit on the quest to find a better life and ended up in my neck of the woods a mess the vibe up. <laughs> you could be dressed in finer hemp attire and I would still hate you with every fibre ah. Trendy biker ah. Gentrifier <laughs> Reason that my rent is higher <laughs> Exemplify the type of guy to wreck the sight of a resting spider, then tell him he's best to hire your recommended web designer. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care about your new splendid diner or the specs of your expensive cider. Don't try and justify your means just because you think the ends are nicer. Um, I ain't angry. It's no problem. I move from Hackney. To Tottenham. <laughs> By the time you get to Tottenham, I'll be in Scotland. Because I see the effing signs on road that like was sold by Foxtons. It's a little London joke, I know. <laughs> but we should all get to running. I'm Jon Snow telling everybody winter's coming. Mm. It's the White Walker's arrival. <laughs> They'll be at the wall by nightfall. Hipsters rising from the dead because they think it's quite cool. <laughs> it's a retro revival. <laughs> Nothing sacred to these zombies. Everything's got to be viral. They pop up in pop ups with their pop up cycles. <laughs> yes. Yo. Touch him, right? <laughs> it's, nice, oh. it's the Og monster. Mm. I'm real. They know what Oggy on. You prep for this battle by putting the office on. <laughs> <laughs> and then show up in a style you copied from your favorite character. This is a comic con. Because mm. you and Adam all about the plagiarism. Shuffle T got a blatant business selling anything from two rhymes to a page of writtens. And you play the system, you get mates rates for the same assistance, it's a grave addiction. Cause you keep needing a bigger dose. You got this pill head running from pillar to post. Cause you can't live with your own shit that you wrote. But don't wanna die so I won't give up the ghost. Before a single line served. You gotta meet Adam so we can go through his mind first. These are the things I've heard and I'm a vegan so I don't mince my words. <laughs> this ain't one on one. So I'm facing a pair still. I don't care, my fruit survivalist, the pair grills. <laughs> I'm Rambo. In the woods. 
It's a rare skill, you could have seven shuffles, still wouldn't be a fair deal. <laughs> two on two champs. What do you mean? <laughs> That's just a fiction. I swear you're the only specialist doubles team in existence. <laughs> they them guys that go laser quest. <laughs> laser quest and take their own equipment <laughs> and shout Top Gun after every nine-year-old victim. <laughs> it's like when I make up prizes for those kids that otherwise wouldn't win them like medal for most improved that wearing plimsolls and remembering to bring them. <laughs> There's different lines in this game. Doubles ain't the same thing, buddy. It's the poor relation. You Jamie Murray. Mm. Bringing shame to mummy. <laughs> Cause you got no hard bar, so just do what you do and make it funny. Let's go. Yeah. Right, question. What do you mean you're a PE teacher? You! You're the slowest person in England, mate! I wasn't at all surprised by this whole election in the States. Forget President Trump, this guy's teaching Year 7s to run! What's he coaching them on sprinting days? Slow and steady wins the race. <laughs> Don't forget to finish eighth. <laughs> His group's 100 metre dash lasts for over a month. <laughs> he loves cross country, because that's slower than fuck. Come to think of it, you are closer to Trump, because you only like certain races, and I thought it was a joke that you run. <laughs> I didn't want to say this, but it... I didn't want to say this, but it's aptly put. I hope every kid in your class gets athlete's foot. <laughs> Yo, this is what it feels like watching four bars from you. <laughs> You'll start your fucking set up and then. <laughs> Through third line now, we're getting a sense of where your path is to. <laughs> but because you can't even multi, the punchline sounds shit and just a little bit too long, and you know it's true. <laughs> if that's a style, it's called the manic depressive. When you talk to me, I pretend you're being passive aggressive. Marlo, it's so blessed to see you, man. I twitching out his socket like it's badly infected while he's reaching for a shank to start stabbing my leg with. I said this, hey Ogmios, would you like some of this cranberry beverage? <laughs> no, thank you, Marlo. I don't like juice. <laughs> secret to hide. Like, he's way too cool-headed and peaceful at times. The only dirt on him that's easy to find is from the trees that he climbs. Hey everyone, hey everyone, you, hey everyone, you should give being vegan a try. Meditation will lead you to the meaning of life. He's beating his wife. You bloody are, aren't you, Ock? You bloody are. I don't believe the soft guy act. Ooh, love the planet. Be zen. I do not buy that. He smashed the window of a Whole Foods for having the wrong tribe brand, and he showed 
he choked his housemate to death when he found his gong chime smashed. <laughs> you ask your girl a simple question and it leaves her with a gulp. She wouldn't let you cock her, so you beat her to a pulp. Inside events, Ogneos, mystical. I believe in the occult. Get through, Ivan. Hackney, I did three for an assault. <laughs> Yo, despite what I said, it's blessed that you're settled, so found yourself a nice Polish girlfriend, she your cherished rose. Was she about to get to know the dark side of her fellas' soul? Cause in that Brexit vote, <laughs> you went for yes to go. Which ain't what you said at home, so now your girl might leave you, that's a different type of exit poll. <laughs> I'm an alien trying to lift your consciousness, but you ain't ready, bro. He meets an enlightened being and shouts, send him home. <laughs> <laughs> you hate me because I was raised up in a separate zone. I came from a state of zen and you a xenophobe. <laughs> Some thought I couldn't handle this. They don't have a clue though, they of average wit. Some said I couldn't handle this, they don't have a clue though. Day of average wit. There's a body on the car and his man is it. It was Oggy in the study with a candlestick. <laughs> where the candle sits, throwing light on my manuscript where I planned all this. Blueprints don't stay on page. You the gatekeeper, I break the cage. You don't see the work that paved the way because I'm low key leaving Earth. This is the great escape. Oh. You study film, so let me say it differently. I'm Stallone, in goal. Save the imagery. Cause just to show you, you won't be taking liberties. I'm too sly for your pen. I escape to victory. Too sly for your pen, let them ponder. Ridiculous punchlines with a few words. I make triple entendres. You struggle to say one thing with a hundred. I came to cremate this dude and let the fragrant fumes pervade the room. And for those that didn't make it through, they can pay and soon watch your pen get smoked on vapor view. <laughs> this the way of the chosen few. I write an opera sitting on the throne of Zeus, Oggy the Celtic God of golden truth, invoked through the vocal tubes. I've broken every mind I've spoken to. Oh go got a fire on Vulcan too In the pantheon of gods I am the goal too I am Pan, a god and a goat too yes. Yes. When Pan pipes up, it's the coldest tune Haunting melodies, the tones of doom Like the devil himself was phoning you yeah. da -da -da -da. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Shuffle who? What's up, my G? Shuffle T. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All the best, bro. Couple schemes, couple schemes. <laughs> Thing. You, you know me. Yeah, he's doing good, man. Oh, yeah, it's a bit about me being bold. It, it was... Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, God, it was dope, that. Oh, you wrote that. <laughs> says he won't expose you in battles if you fucking pay him his bread. <laughs> Yo, it's good to talk, G. Still your phone idea, bruv, you called me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, surreal, recognize surreal. <laughs> Break the fourth. No, no, bro. I'm breaking fifth and sixth rules, bro. Yeah, seventh rules. 
Yes, I am aware that this is not all rhyming. But that's tiring. We ain't all got a fucking special book. A fucking endless list of rhymes. Yeah, yeah, I could give it a try. But if you insist, then fine. Oh, thanks, yeah, I'm a terrific guy. <laughs> Ha, <laughs> huh, yeah, that's a nifty rhyme. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's the twines. Fits in nice. Yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, that's a good one to hear. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Oh, no. <laughs> oh is this the time? <laughs> six to nine, six to nine. Yeah, yeah, good one. Ticking time. Yeah, will it have brilliant. So yeah, shuffle was greasy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He did. Yeah, he stole the phone thing. Corrupted it completely. <laughs> So what's the thing with you, Og? You're mystical. <laughs> Walking around all sentient, thinking you're mystical. Modern day society, modern day society, Ran. You mystical. <laughs> you a bitch with your gangly arms. Miss Tickle. <laughs> I, I need a fourth one, all right? Now look, I heard, uh, I heard something. Very interesting about your trip to America. Just before you get complacent, I had to corroborate the story and check some statements. You were all at a diner giving your orders to gender waitress and you said, I'm vegan, so give me the salad. With a side of sausage, eggs and bacon? <laughs> you fucking hypocrite! Don't believe any of the bullshit he claims. I call this section of the bowel meat gate. In America, he ate beef steak and cheesecake. Was the whole week just one long motherfucking cheat day? <laughs> Behave! You're a disgrace. <laughs> and what about heretic, huh? What would he say? I'll tell you what he'd say. He'd say you sold out, turned to the ways of a predator. Odd went sightseeing out of butchers. Rolled around, in the, rolled around in the steak like a wrestler. The others were like, well, that's pretty strange and irregular. I guess what happens in America stays in America. I saw exclusive footage from his hotel suite. You two get too far, and we really got to... I saw exclusive footage from his hotel suite. You two get too far, and we really got to see what kind of human you are. He was bathing in pig's blood, chewing a heart, laughing hysterically while sucking on a Cuban cigar. You truly are a deplorable piece of shit. The type to act like he wasn't even meaning it. Gets halfway through eating ribs like... Oh no! <laughs> Is there meat in this? Oh. It's the... It's the bones. That's the giveaway. Oh, I've already... I can't just not finish my dinner plate. It's a waste. He's like, this carrot tastes a little stray. Ah, it's a steak. <laughs> Big mistake. So it's Ogmios, the mystical god Mios, that making all his little students jog Mios. <laughs> That confiscates the year 10's pogs me off. That doesn't blog me off, but if he blogged me off, he should definitely call his blog blog me off. <laughs> that doesn't like the way they treat those cats and dogs me off. That campaigning for his very, that campaigning for the rights of those dogs me off. That owns his very own cuddly fucking little fucking dog me off. Then goes to South Korea and gives those dogs a scoff me off. <laughs> that hides a mist in the fog me off and lures your kids into the woods with a chocolate box. <laughs> That pretends to be peaceful and don't flock me off, then gets home and pistol whips his lady with a Glock me off. I mean, props me off. It's 
pretty obvious. <laughs> There's no actual proof from witnesses or cops, Mios. <laughs> but so what, Mios? It's gotta stop, Mios. We gotta get this bloody menace off the block, Mios. And from your head to your motherfucking socks, Mios, you really fucking stink, you need a wash, Mios. I'm literally freestyling now, this is off the top, Mios. I'm gonna stop, Mios. This is a flop, Mios. Really weird way of ending that round. So, okay, see ya, it's fine. <laughs> Man, man, sorry, sorry to call right back. <laughs> Yo, after I called, did Marlo call? No, no, right. Just wanted to clarify that. <laughs> you lying twat. <laughs> yeah. So you've gone against a trainer, a fizzy drink, a biscuit, a twing, a pee. When will you... And the myriad things of this world live in peace. <laughs> Be like me, take it easy. I walk through the forest and bless everything I see. The plants and seeds, rocks, pedal, and of course the trees. The birds alight on branches just to greet me like I'm St. Francis of the sea sea. Sea sea. That's the difference. You want props but lack the wisdom. You battle objects, I battle with them. In this game I call the shots. This is king ball unorthodox. Stick in your quarter box. Get in my way, I'm calling obs. <laughs> You remember that Fanta guy? <laughs> that you battled back in time, part of that team? Just a fucking gun and a stick, right? You thought they'd have them nice, but got battered life. And you saw the anger rise, and you took the gas out of Fanta, and he got flat inside. <laughs> well, Fanta died. <laughs> this was Fanta light. <laughs> well, I couldn't find a Fanta light. So I wrote light under the Fanta sign. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, we, we can both fantasize. <laughs> but I'm not the one that took Fanta's life. You a callous kind of parasite. He was just a kid, that's infanticide. <laughs> but there's karmic law for that flagrant crime. You wish you could go back to that bar and change that night, but you can't erase that time. You pulled the tab, so now it's payback time. Cause you remember Stick? <laughs> From Fanta Stick, that team you battled, right? Little Stick used to roll with his whole Fanta, not Fanta like just Fanta, right? <laughs> and then you and Shuff got mad, there was a savage fight on that tragic night, and you slapped the guy. Well, Stick, I survived! <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, let me out! Let me out! <laughs> oh, 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 it's my bit now, it's my bit. <laughs> Get out, <of> stack! <laughs> <laughs> Yo! <laughs> you left me leaking sap. My arms, neck, and knees hurting. You snapped me so bad I had to see a tree surgeon. <laughs> they put me back together. This is me, but the beast version. This is nature versus man, and you, Steve Owen. You killed my cousin, so war is my chosen path. I'm no olive branch, I'm a blowgun dart, a poison arrow through a broken heart. Every focus bar I wrote was carved into my flesh until my soul was scarred. I got the coldest bark. Like that do 
Doberman in my local park. My dogs got me back like I was thrown afar. You didn't know twigs could be so advanced. But this the oldest craft and I sit on their shoulders in my totem stance. Let the soldiers dance. You'll see an animal come out the stick like Moses staff. <laughs> This is voodoo shit. <laughs> so shut your gob. <laughs> this stick will stick it to the man like, fuck your job. <laughs> Captain's log. <laughs> One, two, six, three, four, seven, two, eight. Yeah. Thanks to Og, I located and killed this cretin today. What are you staring at? <laughs> My luxurious hair and that. Hey, I ain't gonna spare this twat. My ears are drawn on, I ain't hearing that. <laughs> Death to this punk. I'm like you, but on fire. I'm your effigy, son. Even in death, you won't get to me, bruv. I keep it zen as it heats up like a Vietnamese monk. Uh. What? <laughs> Look into the flame. <laughs> I'll make you wish you were never born. Huh? <laughs> How's your head feeling now? Pretty warm! <laughs> shake man, shake man. No, no. <laughs> 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 